Oh wait, hang on. Well, welcome, welcome to Stray, everyone. I'm Karamaku. I'm Doom Dragon. Okay, now back to Luca. <laughs> <laughs> but like, you think that's why everyone fucking says that whatever that guy, fish guy's name is, is Bruno's son or whatever? Um. Because it takes place in the same time period. Stop trying to trip the guy that we're supposed to be following. No. Uh, I don't know to be honest. I. I haven't seen any of the theory videos that talk about it, but like, it just weirds me out that people think that like Bruno has a fish son. Yeah. And it's literally just because. Um, because he uh, says Silencio Bruno. Yeah. Which like. Sure, that might be a point in your favor, but also there's the fact that, like, Bruno's what Bruno wasn't even going to be named Bruno. They just changed it for the song. This must be it. He really left the slums. It's dangerous out there, but I must be sure. I need to know. Let's do this. Um, Let's do it. Also, apparently, Alberto, like, the full name that he gives when he's meeting Luca is apparently a pun uh, in Italian. I don't, I don't quite remember what it is. I think it has something to do with farts. Of course it does. <laughs> I don't 100% know off the top of my head. Oh, well, the cat's home, so cat's good. Oh, God. Oh, never mind. I thought we were... I thought it was, like, grass and stuff. What? I don't know. So, you... Okay, man. <laughs> Listen. Oh, it's raining. I have a lot of stuff going on right now. Did your head still hurt? A little bit. My oh. stomach still hurts a little bit. Because I ate a lot of dinner. Oh, okay. He's coming with us. I didn't know this. Yeah, he's coming with us to find his dad. He's going to go join his dad in the, My in, dad. in the upper levels. I guess. Look at all of these Zerg eggs. They will eat us. I can't do this. I'm not as fast as you. The Zerks will get me for sure. Here, take this badge. And my gun. <laughs> my papa will recognize it. He will know that you're a friend. Of course. <laughs> Even though you can't talk, because you're a fucking kitty cat. I'll open the door for you. Oh my god, he opens the door and just a wave of Zerks come out and just, <laughs> like, chew him up. Just shred him to pieces. Oh, man. Uh, so yeah. Oh, there's no Zerk eggs out here. Why did you bitch out, man? Yeah, you kind of trapped yourself in a very unfortunate situation. There's no Zerks out here either. I was really hoping I'd turn around and there's just a wave of them heading for me. <laughs> it's like that running scene in fucking Little Nightmares. Where they're yeah. just practically crawling over each other to get you. Yeah. Which, like, that scene where they're just, like, trying to eat you and they're, like, clawing over each other to try to get you. Like, what's her name? Nine? Nine. Nine is freaking fucking sticks. She's <laughs> tiny, yeah. Like, she's so thin. There's nothing on her. Why do you want to eat that? Look at how huge this wall is. I remember. It was a symbol of the division between those in the slums and in Midtown. That and the fact that they kept throwing their garbage down here. What a horrible thing to do. Maybe that's why they failed. Alright. Man, um, we're missing a memory. Yeah, oh well. Um. Crap. We should play Little Nightmares on the channel. Uh, I don't know. I was gonna save it for, like, Halloween, but also, uh... Mm. But, like, Re Resident Evil's coming out. We could play it with the short games, though. Yeah, we could. Oh, shit. Why'd you run directly into them? I didn't see them. I was busy looking at the thing on the kitty. Oh, fuck. Uh, no, 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 no. Holy shit, holy shit, holy shit, holy shit. You got shit. this. I'm good. You got this. Oh, fuck. Also, apparently, if you die, like, nine times while playing this game, you get an achievement. Oh, really? Yeah. Cody, Cody, oh, Cody, fuck. Cody, uh, Cody! No, 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 no. We're gonna find out about that nine life thing! It was your turn to play, anyway. No, it wasn't. I played last time. Oh, right. Well, it, never mind. Um... Yay. So now we just know we gotta look out for those zerks. I just wasn't paying attention. Why I was, not? I was busy looking at the cat, man. Why do you need to look at the cat? Because fucking, it's so cute. It's a kitty. Oh, no. Oh, uh, no. Oh, well, I'm gonna die now. I wonder if, like, they... In oh, okay, fuck. I wonder if they intentionally made them look like... They had to have made them look like the head crabs on purpose. Like. I, I don't know. Maybe. I don't know. What are you asking me? I don't know nothing. Have you ever seen a bug made of flesh? Um... Of course not. Gotcha. Trick fucking, question. Fucking dweeb. 
We're probably gonna die a lot here, and then we're gonna get that achievement. Yeah. Also, the girl I watched get the achievement was just like, wait, so I can't play anymore? <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Or like, she didn't understand it was just an achievement and not, oh, well, you died nine times, you fucking suck, you can't play anymore. <laughs> you can't hang out with us cool kids at the lunch table. Get ready to jump. Oof, did it. Yes, no more Zerks from this point out. Oh, fuck. Ooh. Ah, oh, ah, shit. Ah. <laughs> Damn it, I was doing so good. Even you have to admit, I was doing great. Oh, I was hoping he'd just fall straight into the water. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, hey, the you, kitty cat. You kitty need to go cat. down. I know, I know, I got stuck. Kitty cats hate water. Oh, shit. Uh, oh, my God, how many Zerks are there? This is probably why he didn't want to come with us. <laughs> <laughs> I like how we were talking about how like he was a pussy and there weren't any Zerks, and then this shit happens. Well, technically there weren't any Zerks. <laughs> You're right. Oh shit, where do I go? Uh, you jump onto that pipe and then you get momentum. Right. Dude, our cat is such a fucking dweeb. Yes. We've talked about this. Can I get on that? I can't get Oh wait, no, no, no. You go, go back to the old pipe that you jumped on first, and then like... You get momentum again. More momentum. Oh, also, speaking of dweebs... Um, okay, man. There's a new Predator movie out. I don't want to watch it, because it looks really dumb. Like, also, just for the fact that in the trailer... I probably misheard it, but in the trailer, it really just sounded like the Native American dude had a fucking, like, Brooklyn accent or some shit. Yeah, it was, oh, this is cool. Oh, shit, I'm steering. Am I, I'm not steering. Oh. Are you steering? <laughs> No. Oh, well, okay. <laughs> Dude, this cat's fucking defective. Well, he landed on his feet. He just rolled. He did land on his feet. It's just that he couldn't stay on his feet. <laughs> Are you okay? That was a huge fall. Doc should be nearby. We must be close. Now, start Get limping. shit on if you have an injury. Why'd you go in a circle? <laughs> I don't know. But, like, um... Uh, she was going to say. Right. Oh, I, okay, cool. We just like uh, I just stopped and licked my paw to make it better. Let me let me talk. Okay. But like we uh when we first saw the uh trailer for Prey, we joked about like uh all the guys on the hunt having like different fucking accents. <laughs> all the Native Americans <laughs> just like having like very diverse accents, like one's a Russian dude and one's a cowboy or some shit like that. <laughs> they just they got diversity. <laughs> they just did it wrong. <laughs> Cuz like like, in the trailer, she's like, why can't I go on the hunt? And he's just like, you just can't. You can't, Lara. <laughs> you can't go on the hunt, Lara. Women ain't allowed. <laughs> <laughs> it's fucking stupid. But, like, uh, uh, we watched someone, like, review it. At the end of the movie, the, 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 what, what? Spoiler alert, by the way. Uh, no, I'm not gonna spoil the whole thing. But, like, at the end of the movie... Oh, we have there's, to get a thing to use. There's a part where the fucking Yetcha just rips his own arm off in rage, and I'm just like, why? Hmm. What kind of dumbass Yetcha is this? <laughs> it's an electrical generator, but it seems to require some other part to function. Yeah, like, that's. It wasn't that he, like, just ripped his arm off, it's that he was swinging his shield around when his shield was razor sharp, and he accidentally cut his own arm off. Like, what kind of fucking dweeb is, like, an ultimate hunter species and, and then fucking lops off his own arm? By like accident. A, like a fucking nitwit. Like, that's so fucking stupid. And that's the only way she wins, too. Yeah, he just literally gets so angry he fucking rage quits. Man, talk about trying to, like, empower women with the movie that the only way she could win is the guy handicaps himself. Because <laughs> <laughs> um, it's like the whole movie, she's just running from the predator the whole time. Like, every single time it appears. Or, what's it? I don't know. I'm going to yeah, call it's, it the it's... Predator because he's hunting them. Yeah. Cause, but, like, every single time he appears, um... she just takes off fucking running. Yeah, she just books it. She just fucking leaves. I need to find, like, a plug or something. I'm having a hard time. Th there, wasn't there a plug at the machine? No, I gotta find, like, something to plug into the machine because it's, uh, it's missing a thing. Oh. Uh... But, like, I, I just don't like the title either. I don't like Prey. It sounds fucking stupid. Also, there's already other movies named Prey. Didn't you make a point of, like, you didn't like the name Prey because all the... Because, like, all the other movies are called Predator and it's making, like, the, um... 
like Native Americans sound weak. <laughs> yeah. Well, also, Ooh, that's a that's quite the web they have down that alleyway. <laughs> oh yeah. Uh, also, I think it's this. I know this is probably going to come off as me being like some douchey white dude. How the fuck is it that a fully trained, fully armed team of fucking U.S. Navy SEALs or whatever they were in the fucking first movie, like highly trained military personnel, can't take out a fucking Yaucha? But then in fucking Prey, <laughs> I don't like this. a bunch of fucking dweebs with bow and arrows take him out. Well, that's because it's different. He's a different ethnicity. <laughs> he is. He's a desert predator. And, like, yeah, he's less advanced, but also they're less advanced. So, if anything, that puts them more on, like, fucking even playing field. Oh. What the fuck? Oh, it's a pet. Oh, no. He's... Oh, it's pet zerks. Oh, I, for a fucking second, I thought he had, like, fuck. Uh, oh, that's a knife. What's it called? Pee pads down. <laughs> I thought he had pee pads down. Oh, man. But, like, yeah, it's just, it's fucking ridiculous. And, like, yeah, I get it. It's, like, yeah, it's a less advanced uh, Yaucha. It doesn't have, like, the same equipment. As... And apparently is stupid enough to lop off his own arm. <laughs> yeah, but, like, also, they're less advanced. They have, like, shittier equipment. They're using fucking bow and arrows and knives that they're just creating with, like, sticks and rocks. And his equipment's not that less that much less advanced than a fucking regular Yauch's. Oh, shit! <laughs> it's fucking ludicrous. It's stupid. I also heard that this guy's, like, a reference to, like, Back to the Future. Yeah. I can see it. Whoa! <laughs> Wait, you're not a Zerk, are you? I, I don't know. This is going to be his voice because I can't. Have, don't you have Zerks tied up, or not tied up, caged up upstairs? You know what a Zerk looks like. <laughs> That's my badge you're wearing. How did you find it? Did my son send you? Oh, Seamus, you clever boy. Sorry, I just, because it's like, it's a pin, right? So you know how pins have like the sharp thing that makes them stick to the fabric? Yeah. Just imagine he like had it straight out and just... <laughs> <laughs> I've been alone here for ages. I came here to test my defluxer, but it didn't go as planned. I blew myself up! It wasn't fluxing enough. <laughs> <laughs> I died, unfortunately. I wish I could go back home. I miss my son dearly. Why can't you go home? Because my fucking defluxer doesn't work! Weren't you paying attention, nerd? <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> Slaps the cat. <laughs> you can have a look around the house if you want, but I have no idea how to escape this place. He just can't figure out how to open the fucking door. Jump down. But yeah, back to like prey. It's it's fucking ludicrous and stupid. Like I know it's supposed to be like a woman empowerment thing or whatever, but like I, I'm gonna stick to the point of like it's not because they have to handicap the guy she's fighting in order for her to win. <laughs> I've seen humans wear costumes like this. Uh, they were small and running around making lots of noise. Oh, yes, I remember now. They were children. <laughs> ah, yes, children. <laughs> the streets felt much more alive with them. Even with the difficulty they brought, the adults seemed to love them very much. Doc says he misses Seamus. Is that the same thing? Well, like, also, yes, I do understand, like, in the first Predator movie, Dutch did beat the Yaucha just using, like, fucking... Sticks and stones and traps and shit. To break his bones. Shut up. I'm assuming this is the defluxer he was talking about. We're stuck. The Zerks will attack as soon as we step outside. Okay, fucking... Yeah, I know. Mm. We got here on a fucking, like, minecar or some shit like that. What if the cat just, like, bats it off the shelf and that, like, powers it up? Hey, be careful with that defluxer. At full charge, it can explode Zerks like confetti. Are you fucking serious? This baby needs 1.21 gigawatts to work. And the only thing around here with that kind of juice is the generator outside the house. It's not really outside your house, so it's like it's fucking across like eight streets. The problem is that it won't start. I think a fuse blew, and with all the Zerks around, it's too dangerous for me to go fix it. Isn't a whole neighborhood just your house if no one else lives there? Fair. I'm not fast enough. But here just might be. If you can reach the generator and place the fuse, I should be able to get the defluxer recharged. Come on, follow me! Jumps out the window. <laughs> Please jump out the window now that you've said something. <laughs> I'll show you what to do. I want that to happen in this game so badly. Where someone just jumps out the window? Yeah. It almost happened. Almost. Not quite, though. Unfortunately. Also, in between... Last episode in this episode, I took a nap and apparently you said I was somersaulting in my sleep. Yeah, pretty much. 
Like, you toss and turn way more than me when you sleep. Here, take this fuse. It's brand new. I just shat it out. <laughs> and here, take this. It's my penis. Won't do anything. I just don't want it anymore. Turning on the generator will be loud, so expect some sex. Since I'm a robot, I can't experience the touch of a woman, so now I must get rid of this. Oh, so all us robots are dudes, so... We don't uh, know that. That's fair. Those... But there was one named Zoe. Yeah, there so. was Yeah, there was one named Zoe, and she was cool. She had a cowboy hat. <laughs> yeah. Once you fix the generator, I should be able to charge and kickstart the defluxor. You just need to follow this cable, change the fuse, then meet me back here, make an omelette, turn that omelette upside down, kill a cow, turn the sun upside down. Build a plane. <laughs> Fly that plane, crash it, come back here and defeat, and then we can go. <laughs> and then you'll have to do the most impossible task ever. And he, like, holds up some earbuds that are tangled. <laughs> Untangle these earbuds. The cat bats in and it just, like, untangles itself. And it's like, you fucking bastard! <laughs> <laughs> Best of luck! Good luck, bitch boy! And he slams the fucking window down. <laughs> so now we know that the glowy bits are eggs. Which, I don't like that. Yeah, no, that's horrifying. Um, God, I really want Roanoke to do an analysis on the fucking Zerks because... The thing is, will he? I don't know. He does video games. He's been doing a lot of movies here lately. Which, Which kind would, of... Sorry. You go ahead. Because it's like, the thing is, um, can he do an analysis of this? Because it's like, they tell us what these things are. Yeah, but like, he could explain, you know, biologically, how does a bacteria become a large multicellular organism? What I can't do is powerhouses. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> I smart. I am so smart. S-M-R-T. I mean, S-M-E-R-T. Okay, Kermit. Um, but yeah, cause it's like, this, excuse me, the Zerks, like, they don't make sense. Cause that's not how that works. A bacteria cannot just evolve to be a multicellular organism. Uh, oh no, is this a Zombies 2 thing again? Where like, they say they made a virus or a bacteria or something and it's, it turns out it was compl something completely, like, something completely different. They're just like, it just works. It just <laughs> works. Finally! Uh -oh. And he points it at his own head. <laughs> I was gonna say, it was like, uh, it glows, he's like, uh oh, and an explosion happens in the background. Oh no. Oh shit, okay, cool. Damn. Holy fuck. Oh my god. Jesus. Oh wait, no, but it's on the other side. Oh, he's helping us. <laughs> wait, no! Oh no, fuck. Cody! He'll help me! I told you. Oh fuck. <sighs> okay. <laughs> In. I just realized I laughed the fucking uh, beat to uh, I don't know the name of the song. Da, 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 da. Yeah. That's what I laughed. I didn't even realize it. Well, I don't think anyone else did. You're the only one thinking about it. All right. Well, listen. I'm tired. Amazing! You got the generator back on, and my flashlight works again. Give ah! me my penis back. <laughs> Cat runs off with it, and he never sees it again. Have you seen how powerful the defluxer is? It's definitely our way out of here. Wait a minute! I may be able to mount the defluxer on your drone. I feel like the drone is kind of the mastermind of this situation. Also, I've been thinking about it, and, like, I think our uh, the way we sleep, like, evens out how much space is taken on the bed. How so? Because it's like, you say when I fall asleep, I try to push you off, but, like, when you fall asleep, you push me up against the wall. <laughs> You either do that or you squish me. <laughs> it worked. The defluxer is now installed on your fancy drone there. Don't uh -oh. know why you need to specify that he's fancy. Uh-oh, our controller's dying. It's not meant to be run- It's- oh, fuck. It's not meant to be run off such a small power source. If you use it too much, it could malfunction and explode. Just remember, it's dangerous to go alone. Now let's go back to the village. I'm coming home, son. Or I could go get your son and bring him here. Or, you know, we can take him back to the village. Wait, explode his babies. Uh, how do I do it? Yes. Nope. Oh. Uh, did he not tell us how to do this? He or? did not. Okay, so I guess we can't just... We're, I guess we'll just leave these here. It's fine. I mean, they're not bothering anybody. 
I could just annoy them. What if it turns out that, like, the, um, the virus that's supposed to eat everything didn't mutate by itself? It, like, latched on to something fleshy and mutated that to do it. It was a bacteria. Or, yeah. Which I don't know if a bacteria can really do that. Okay, how do I do it? How do I activate the defluxer? Give me a hint here. Take out all those eggs so we can get through. I would love to. Oh, it's L1. Wow, it's working great. But as I suspected, it can overheat. Let it cool for a bit when that happens. I hope it will last until we reach the village. One, one second. One second. Please. Dude, you're gonna come back and he's fucking dead. <laughs> it's just a pile of scrap metal. One second, sir. One second. Let me just, uh... There we go. <laughs> <laughs> no witnesses. <laughs> oh, man. Great. Okay. Um. Oh shit. Also, as I was like fading in and out of consciousness, which is what I was doing, I wasn't actually fully asleep. Yeah, that's how you sleep. No. <laughs> <laughs> this switch doesn't work. It looks like the electricity has been cut. Oh no! Is this a fucking escort mission? Yes. How's it going? <laughs> um. I but yeah, oh. continue as you were fading in and out of consciousness. Because it's, it's like you were coming in and out of the room or something. I don't remember. Maybe some of those weren't real. <laughs> some of them were a ghost, Cody. Yeah. And um, yeah. And then the, so it was just like... Um, shoot, there's something else. I don't remember. It's hard. Okay. Dreams are hard. Um, and I was, I was supposed... I was thinking that like... You, uh, we were getting ready to record again, but then you came in and you, like, changed the cables, but then, like, I imagined my computer was back on again, or something. Like, everything was, like, set up fine. I don't know. I was fading in and out, and I don't remember a lot of it. <laughs> I mean, I did change the cables at one point. Oh, boy. Yeah, y use your thingy. Hang on. I wanted to get them all together. <gasps> oh. Oh shit. Oh shit. Cody, oh shit. Cody, save him. Cody. I can't. It's overheating. Oh shit. Now they're just running. Oh, I died. Oh, well, bye. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> Peace out, nerd. <laughs> what was I thinking? Trusting my fl my flux to a cat. <laughs> Those things are so stupid. How much time do we have? Uh, about eight oh, minutes. Okay. We're good. You gotta pull that switch. Oh, fine. But the switch is the thing that made the Zerks appear. But yeah, I was trying to get them all together because it overheats, remember? Where are you going? <laughs> Dude, fuck that science nerd, am I right? Well, I'm coming to get him. <laughs> you decided to it, be... It opens automatically. Oh, fuck. Oops. Sorry. 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 <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, no, excuse me for trying to save a guy. Ah, oh, fuck. Sorry. <laughs> a lot of them are getting in, buddy. You got this, Lonnie. Do I? Yeah. Maybe. No. It's gonna turn out that the Zerks are like bacteria that infected other cats or some shit. They're all cats? I mean, I would guess like a rodent, maybe. Uh, so, the th read it. so the thing I said earlier where it's like it infected something else and that's what the, the Zerks are. I mean, again, not. I don't know. I don't know. If, if like... Roanoke ever decides to like do something with this, we'll find out. I don't know that bacteria could really mutate DNA to that extent. Because, like, single-celled organisms can get pretty big. Like, there's that uh, there's that am amoeba in the ocean that's, like, eight inches in diameter, which is fucking huge. Oh, man. I... Oh, oh, okay, it's just you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait. <laughs> that's how I greet all my friends. I just start screaming at them. I don't have friends, so I just greet anyone like that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you... 
lose your mind when like we wake up or when I'm awake and I do anything that like even slightly shakes the bed. You will explode. They just start screaming. Dead. Zerks just start flooding in. <laughs> I like how their faces are so blank too. He just starts. Cr what if he like has the? Uh, uh, I was hoping that he would get like the little <laughs> like lines down his face to simulate tears. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the heart screen is even better. Oh, uh, that's sweet. I like that we awed a fucking unison. Oh, yes, thank you. <laughs> thank you. That's all I've ever wanted. Oh, now I can is, finally die. <laughs> this is awesome. Thanks for saving Doc, little friend. It's great to see that Seamus is no longer alone. Nah, he's still alone. Now we know that we can fight back against the Zerks. Momo has been waiting for you by the sewers. It's really fucking smelly. Dog and Seamus look happy. I think we did a good thing here, together. Shut up. <laughs> Shut so, up. So, he's like, where is he? By the sewers. Uh, where you're not paying attention. Wait, vending machine. You can get the last uh, energy drink that you need. Oh yeah, let's go to that one guy and just buy the last of his shit. Let's just buy all of his stuff. Make it, put him out of business. <laughs> cat, cat, cat. Go through the crap. No fucking shit. Cat, cat, cat. <laughs> Put him out of business. Make him regret being born. Okay, what you got here? Let me see. Let me see. Let me see what you got. Give uh, me. Come on, do it. Give it. Here you go. Oh, it was a memory. Is this the one that we're missing? Probably. This is an early model of a companion. Back then, they didn't have any personality. They were just glorified autonomous cleaners. Cool. I think it's nice that they eventually mimic humans. It's like they missed them, and in a way, they kept them uh, from going extinct. Oh, so these aren't like robots or humans downloaded into robot bodies. These are just robots that gain sentience. Which, like, uh, if AI gets advanced enough, that'll happen, so. The good robot. Oh, yeah, there we go. Oh, wait, we're missing another one. <laughs> That's from the area we just were at, too. Uh, let's so we don't even get to take the picture, we just have it. Uh, one energy drink can. Uh, okay. <laughs> Give me one dollar. <laughs> Here you go. Got it. Cool. Didn't so, need it, but we got it. I mean, we can take it to that guy with the guitar and just, like, start giving him music sheets. Wait, do we have to give it to him, or, like, does he just play him? Uh, we have to give it to him for him to play them. Oh, okay, but, like, uh, we don't need to do that. Eh, it's a waste of time. I mean, he's right there. Oh, yeah, hi, dude. <laughs> But, like, he doesn't take them, does he? Yeah, he does. Oh, he does? Yeah, so we'll get him out of our inventory. Uh, yeah. Okay. Tomorrow's. Alright, let's listen to it. Food! <laughs> <laughs> you want to sit on the little pile of pillows? Has Stray even gone off in the channel yet, I just realized? Nope. Wow. Well, technically... Uh, Technically, by the time this episode's up, Stray would be technically be up on the channel. It's just, n right now, it's not. Not at all. We are not even through the last two weeks of Danganronpa. Oh my god, are you serious? Can I just kill myself? Well, I mean, why? You're not even playing Danganronpa anymore. It's just, it's the it's the fact that it's like, just... Not done? Yeah, dude. Uh, so we have to wait for him to finish one song in order for us to uh, give him another. You do that, buddy. Song. <laughs> I think he finished the song right as we were walking away, too. Uh, oh, he did? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what, well, Midnight does this to you? <laughs> That's true. My body is a fucking jungle gym for that monster. Cool down. Alright, dude, let's get jiggy with it. I actually like this one. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this one is nice. This one's pretty fucking jiggy, dude. He's just leaping all over the place. That's what cats do. You know, we don't have to...
stay here. We can just come back later. Fine, I guess so. Where, or we can just, or we can, like, where is the sewers? That's, was, that's all I on. need to know. I was about to say, we could just, like, keep giving... Because we have two minutes left. We have one minute left. Do you just want to keep giving him, like, music sheets for the rest of the episode? <laughs> <laughs> He's got Sumis! Look out! I just like the way he slides. I mean, yeah. Yeah, no, Midnight has God, decided... God, this fucking song's a jam. <laughs> oh, yeah. The fact that he's playing it on a fucking jerry can. Dude, this is fucking great. This is fucking great. This song's awesome, jeez. Oh, that was the end of it. Oh, no, you're done? Ah, oh, dude. Uh, yeah, I got more. Mildly important information. <laughs> oh, this one's composed by a renowned, renowned algorithm. Cool. You know, that is very interesting, though. Like, we are kind of reaching the age where, like, robots can have... Oh, this one's also pretty good. But, like, we are reaching the age where, like, robots can have creativity. And they can, like, make shit. Like, there are AI-generated images that exist now. Yeah, but, like... And it's... They're, but, like, they still need help from people to do that. They do still need help from people, but, like, the fact that, like, you, you just feed them the information and then they can create something with it. And it's not perfected considering some of them turned out pretty cursed. Yeah, that's true. But, like, the basic one... Like, there's a website you can go to and you can just look, like, look up anything, like, dinosaur riding a ball. And it will create an image of a dinosaur riding a ball. I do know they have problem recreating people. Yeah, which is very interesting. I guess it's just like the diversity amongst humans or it, some it, shit. The, the, the random genes that can just appear on people is not understand by like not understood by AI. I guess so. Uh, but like we are getting into the area where like AIs can just make shit. They can eventually they will be able to like create music and stuff. And it's going to be fucking awesome. They just can't see color. <laughs> <laughs> They'll never be able to see color. They'll, They'll just... never be racist. Yeah, so we got to worry about it. Yeah, somebody invented, like, a version of chess that, like, robots can't play because it's too complicated for them. Why? I don't know. Fuck them. Fuck those machines. Like, you ever seen Tron? No. No. Well, in Tron, they're, like, playing the game. Like, a, that's they, like, foreshadow that the character is an AI by having her, like, playing the game against the dude. And the dude is doing great, but the girl is struggling. So that's how you know that, like, oh, she's an AI. Uh, well, uh... Yeah, we gotta end the episode. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, this has been... Sp this has been Stray. Look at these pure fucking vibes, man. We just got done killing countless creatures. Well, I mean, they're kind of a blight on the world, so... I mean... It doesn't matter. Yeah, morality. I mean, it's uh, encouraged to kill invasive species anyway, so... That's true. That's why sometimes I just drive down to Florida with a Glock and start taking out um, lionfish. Why'd you go to Florida without me? I don't know. Do you want to go to Florida? Disney World's there. I, I, I gotta be honest, I'm afraid of going to Disney World. Why? Because it's advertised like the perfect place, but also I'm overweight and white. Cody, half of the people there are overweight and white. I know. I don't like being around my own kind. All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is this has been a uh, stray. This is super fun. Um, I'm very much enjoying this game. The ending is just gonna sneak right up on us, and uh, we'll see you guys next time. Goodbye. Goodbye.